Hello and welcome back to the GCP Mindset channel. Today, we'll talk about what are investigator meetings and clinical trials. More after the intro. Welcome to the GCP Mindset channel and all topics on clinical research. For those embarking on a journey in the field of clinical research, understanding the various processes and roles within clinical trials is essential. Clinical trials are a vital component of the medical field as they lay the foundation for medical advancements and breakthroughs. In clinical trials, every role is crucial and every meeting holds significance in ensuring that the trial is conducted smoothly and ethically. One such important aspect of clinical trials is an investigator meeting. Let's start by understanding what these meetings are and why they hold such critical importance. Investigator meetings are collaborative events where all investigators involved in a particular clinical trial come together. The primary purpose of these meetings is to ensure that all investigators clearly understand the trial protocol and can perform consistently across multiple sites. So who attends these meetings? Investigators, clinical research coordinators, research nurses, CRAS, and other key personnel involved in the trial participate in investigator meetings. These meetings provide an opportunity for everyone to get on the same page regarding the trial's objectives, procedures, potential challenges, and solutions. The paramount importance of investigator meetings lies in their role to ensure that all investigators thoroughly understand the trial protocol. This is because consistency and accuracy are key in conducting successful clinical trials. By standardizing procedures across multiple sites, investigator meetings play a crucial role in maintaining the integrity of the trial data. These meetings also serve as a platform for discussing potential challenges that may arise during the course of the trial and brainstorming possible solutions. This proactive approach helps mitigate risks and ensure smooth execution of the trial. Furthermore, investigator meetings provide training on trial-specific procedures and requirements. This ensures that everyone involved is well-equipped to carry out their roles efficiently thereby improving overall trial outcomes. Typically, investigator meetings comprise several components. The most important is the presentation of the trial protocol. Here, the trial's objectives, design, procedures, and ethical considerations are explained in detail. Training sessions are another integral part of these meetings. These sessions equip investigators with the necessary knowledge and skills to carry out their roles effectively. They may cover a variety of topics, from data collection methods to reporting adverse events. Interactive sessions for questions and discussions also form a significant part of investigator meetings. These sessions allow investigators to clarify any doubts they might have and contribute their insights and suggestions. Lastly, regulatory and ethical considerations related to the trial are discussed. This ensures that the trial is conducted in compliance with all applicable regulations and ethical standards. As an investigator, preparing for these meetings can hugely impact your understanding and execution of the trial protocol. To start with, make sure you are familiar with the basic information about the trial. This includes knowing the objective of the study, the target patient population, and the key procedures involved. Active participation is another important aspect of these meetings. Don't hesitate to ask questions or share your perspectives. After all, these meetings are meant to be a collaborative platform. Moreover, understanding the trial protocol is crucial. Make sure you thoroughly review it before the meeting and note down any queries you might have. Remember, a clear understanding of the protocol will enable you to conduct the trial more effectively. In conclusion, investigator meetings hold tremendous importance in clinical trials. They ensure consistency across multiple sites, provide training on trial-specific procedures, and offer a platform for discussion and collaboration. 
It's important to embrace these meetings as opportunities for learning and growth. By actively participating in these meetings and thoroughly understanding the trial protocol, you can contribute to the successful execution of clinical trials. So approach these meetings with an open mind, eager to learn and ready to contribute to the fascinating world of clinical research. Thank you for watching our video, and we hope that you found it informative. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more content on clinical research. We look forward to see you next time.